Hello my loves and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be reviewing another skincare product and you may be noticing I do currently have some acne on my skin and right off the bat I want to say this is not caused by the product that I was testing out at all. This was actually due to hormone imbalances which never really happens for me. But anyway, this is the current condition of my skin and I have been testing out the Ordinary Skincare 2% Salicylic Acid Solution for I would say about two months now. And on that note, this product is designed for people with oily skin, acne prone skin, those who deal with a lot of clogged pores and blackheads. For me, I have dry sensitive combination skin that is also dehydrated and this product did did dry out my skin a little bit. However, it does have a rather dense consistency for a liquid-based product. I would say it's in between that of a lotion and an essence. It does have an amazing spreadability on that note. I would say it has a slight hydrating factor to it, which gives it the spreadability and a slight moisturizing effect to the skin. Now, if you do have oily skin, this is not going to really give you an effect that would encourage more oil production. As for me, I do notice that whenever I use BHA products and specifically when I use this one, my skin does tend to become dry during the use. So I don't tend to use it that often, maybe twice a week on average. For me, I like to focus this product right onto the center of my skin and a few drops definitely goes a long way. Now, in terms of that slight hydrating effect, you can see close up on my skin that when you spread the product, it does kind of foam up, which is a little bit interesting, but I have had this experience before with other BHA products like the Paula's Choice one. Now on that note, it does leave my skin feeling slightly hydrated, but then over time, like when I wake up in the morning, it does feel a little more dry. Now in terms of the actual product results, I honestly didn't notice much of a difference on my skin. This is the first time I've used a BHA product and haven't experienced really any benefits. I am not too sure if it's just because my skin doesn't really need BHAs anymore or if this product just didn't really work for me. It didn't do much for reducing blackheads, it didn't do much for reducing the amount of clogged pores I have, and it certainly didn't do anything to help the current acne breakout I had on my face, which went away over time once that time of the month finally came around. So let me know in the comment section down below what you guys thought as I'd love to find out and of course subscribe to see more review videos and check out my social media channels to stay up to date on my daily life. I love you guys so much and I'll see you next time. Bye!